If you're a child of the 80s, like me, you'll remember Tom Cruise hopped in his parents' Porsche to give chase to a pimp thief. Since the beginning of time, cars have been an exciting part of our favorite movies, and during the movie Risky Business, the teenager versus villain car chase was born, adding another layer to the age-old genre. There is no substitute for a great car crime thriller. Since Corona shut down the theaters in early 2020, we haven't been able to see our favorite spy cars kick ass on the big screen. Don't worry if you have to sit around in your little Nissan Sentra, stay home and dream of a much better ride. These are the top 10 movie secret agent wonders. Just buckle up your seatbelt, wear your mask and let's hit the road. We're on an impossible mission to review the top 10 fiend-catching, blockade-busting secret agent cars. Number 10. Black Beauty Modified 1965 Chrysler Imperial – The Green Hornet The Chrysler Imperial Crown 1965 would make Lee Iacocca proud. The car is sophisticated and classy and also very safe to drive. Think of it like a car that you want to ride on in a parade. Then, after dinner, you can catch the evil doer with your Black Beauty flamethrower, machine gun system and body armor. All in the same day in your two-wheel sedan with anti-riot spokes. Ejector seats would have been a good idea for this car. Put on your fedora and you can go for a ride. Number 9. 1967 Pontiac GTO Custom Hardtop Xander Cage Triple X Loud and proud this car with the wood paneling began with a V8, a 400CU and 335 horsepower to be the go-to car for Vin in his various action movies. Only Vin can make the wood panel dash not look like the Brady Bunch wagon. Number 8. Futuristic Lexus – Chief John Anderton – Minority Report Whether you're riding on top of the car or inside the car, it's always a smooth ride. Catch your bad guy and look good doing it. In the movie, the car drove itself. Lexus 2054 was modeled as a concept car for the movie Minority Report. The vehicle went from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.7 seconds and had a top speed of 155 miles per hour. Number 7. The Mystery Machine – Mystery Ink Gang – Scooby-Doo Movies Not just a spring-colored work van, these Crime Stoppers have an array of colors in their arsenal. The van of blue and green with the back window portrait of Shaggy and his pooch Scooby may be painted in chick colors, however, it's a his and hers van where guy and girl detectives spend much of their days cruising for ghosts and degenerates. Don't let the purple bumpers fool you. This van has eight windows. 318 V8 with a three-speed manual. The 1967 Dodge Ram van has a great deal of room for all the gang and their Scooby Snacks. Number 6. Chrysler and Voyager – John and Jane Smith in Mr. and Mrs. Smith Getting your groceries without getting killed is a great feature with this family sedan. With the guns in your backseat, no need to worry about keeping two car lengths away. The wish of every secret agent suburban housewife everywhere. Don't be tempted to shoot out the windows of that woman who got too close to you in the parking lot. Those windows are bulletproof. Number 5. Volkswagen Beetle and Cadillac for Time Travel – Austin Powers – The Austin Powers Movies This car has rainbow colors, and with the rainbows, the sun is always out in this car. The Beetle – It was manufactured by Vauxhall with a two-door convertible with an automatic transmission. Austin Powers did a lot of time traveling also in his 1969 Cadillac Eldorado going to 1975 probably to check out his new rhinestone cowboy clothing from Glen Campbell, or maybe the new Shining Star music from Earth, Wind & Fire. Since Austin always had a pretty lady to visit with, whoever he met probably enjoyed the ride in either vehicle with him. With a plate like Swinger 2, he always made friends everywhere he went. Number 4. 1972 Corvette Convertible – Detective James Carter – Rush Hour Trilogy we saw that Jackie Chan would rather listen to the Beach Boys on the radio in the Corvette. He quickly learned that this is a car to be seen in no matter what station's playing. With or without Rally SS rims, it's gorgeous with four speeds of awesome. With a 200 brake horsepower and some excellent color choices like Ontario Orange, Warbonaut Yellow, Pewter Silver and Mill Maglia Red, people will spot you miles away. Number 3. The Tumbler – Batman the Dark Knight movies. With a top speed of 80 to 90 miles per hour, this custom-made vehicle was built to speed 
jump, and do all the hard work so Batman can concentrate on getting his villain as soon as possible. There were at least seven of this vehicle, and at a cost of about half a million dollars, the Chevy engine was made for our superhero. Great tires and an excellent computer system. You can be racing after the criminals or driving toward danger. This vehicle will keep all your crime-fighting systems close at hand. In a tight spot, turn yourself into a motorcycle. Number 2. Agent K's Modified 1987 Ford LTD Crown Vic Agent K Men in Black Trilogy A rear-wheel drive vehicle that may still be on the road in some places, formerly used by many police agencies. If you were undercover, you could sit and watch your target or blend in with cars on the road. This car can make a street appearance with the V8 engine. This roomy sedan seat 6, all the bad guys ride in the back. The aliens always ride in the trunk. And number one, Aston Martin DB5, James Bond, the Bond movies. One of the first James Bond movies featured this car. Originally made by Touring in 1963 to 1965, the theme song seems to play in your head. Don't forget to wear your tuxedo while enjoying all the features this car shows off. As a driver, you can play Secret Agent 007 and use the smokescreen, bulletproof windshield, and machine guns installed near the headlights. Made by Touring, this car is a 4.0 liter, 3995cc, 282 to 325 horsepower, and a straight six. The top speed, 145 miles per hour. Add some classical music and a winding countryside, and you can cruise or chase the bad guys. Trying to stay even more under the radar, you can even switch plates if you think you're spotted by the villain. It's going to be hard not to spot this car and it makes the top for the secret agent movie vehicles. Okay, that's our list. What did you think? What would you add? What would you take off? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, like and subscribe and tell your friends. And we'll see you guys in the next one.